Okay, I have a uh, Ilco Challenge lock with a Yale Keyway. The lock does work. It doesn't want to work counterclockwise uh, because the pins are hanging in the lock, but it does work clockwise. Okay, it is locked up. This is the bidding on the key. It will work part of the time counterclockwise, but not all the time. So anyway, let's uh, open it up, take a look at the pins, see what we've got in it. But uh, it is a slightly paracentric keyway, you know, just like all the Yales. We're going to uh, try to work uh, off of this ledge on this side instead of trying to go up this way. It would be almost impossible to get to the pick, uh, pins that way, so we're going to try to work off that one ledge. Okay, let's uh, use the bottom of the keyway. And let's take this pick to start with. Let's go to the uh, back of the lock. Let's come forward. Okay, there's pin uh, three, I believe, or pin four, and then pin three. Okay, let's go back to the back again. Okay, a little bit on pin five. It's pin two. Pin one. Okay, now I believe we need just a little bit deeper pick. So let's uh, try this one. See if we can get to the back of the lock. Get under the pin. We're just not getting any, really any kind of feedback now. Okay, there it is open on pin three. Okay, let's uh, open it up, take a look at the pins. All right, let's see if we can uh, slide this out without too much trouble. Okay, slid it out, almost dropped the plug, but we caught it. Okay, all pins are working. Alright, looks like we've got um, that pin is kind of wallered out. That one is. So is that one. And that one. Okay, one, three, four, and five 
it's kind of enlarged that one might be a little bit okay let's take a look at the pins now okay let's take a close look at the plug Okay, all pin chambers are threaded. Okay, you can tell that uh, part of these are slightly enlarged. That's not the uh, ledge that we're checking there. Check this other side. Okay, that is the ledge, but um, either enlarged, some are, um, it looks like they are enlarged compared to um, this one, and even this one's not that way, but one, three, and four may be slightly enlarged, but they are all three. Let's take a look at our uh, top pins now. Okay, there is a uh, similar to a acetite pin. That's a uh, serrated type pin. There's another um, serrated type pin. Okay, pin five. I know that's pin five, pin four. There's pin four. Then just like this. Okay, looks like there is uh, some threading in one, two, and five. All right, let's take a close look at the pins. This one has a uh, spool and then a smaller uh, end on the t top of the key pin. This is similar to an acetite pin. This is smaller on the bottom. Another uh, serrated key pin. Okay, this one is a little smaller on the bottom. And the serrated key pin, serrated uh, upper pin. This is a serrated key pin. This is a serrated uh, spool type uh, upper pin. Another spooled key pin and smaller at the top on the key pin. This is another uh, similar to a double spool. Okay, that's what we have in this um, Milko with a Yale Keyway. Please stay out of trouble. Please do not do anything illegal. And thank you very much.